Well, this is the kind of match every football fan looks forward to. A lot on the line and the likelihood of a tension-packed occasion. Stay tuned, we'll have all the action for you live here on EA TV. It is a city where passion for football is red hot. Welcome to Naples in southern Italy. I'm Derek Ray and I'm joined here on the gantry for commentary by Stuart Robson. And the focus is very much on Serie A, the top division here in Italy. What do you anticipate seeing, Stuart? Thanks, Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly, pinning the opposition back, playing the ball forward and regaining possession as quickly as possible. Hopefully, we get a really good game here. The Napoli starting 11. David Ospina begins in goal. Lorenzo Insigne starts with Matteo Politano in the wide areas. And rather than use a strike partnership, they've gone with just the one player in attack. This is the initial 11 for the visitors today. Wojciech Szczęsny between the posts. Matthijs De Ligt plays with Giorgio Chiellini in central defence. Denis Zakaria plays alongside Adria Radio in the centre of the park. And the story in attack is one of a strike partnership. It should have a lot to say for itself this game. Napoli with the kickoff here. Good use of advantage by the referee. And the pass not quite accurate enough. And a throw in then. And the referee retrospectively will go back and hand out the yellow card. Politano. It's with Onguisa. Well, such an important contributor for his side, Piotr Zielinski. Stuart, what do you think we might see from him in this game? Well, Derek, when he's on form, when he's focused, he's a brilliant runner with the ball. He can take on players, he can go past people with ease, and he's got a great shot on him as well. I'm really looking forward to watching him play today. Well, his control let him down badly, and it's going to be a goal kick. Alexandro Locatelli with it and showing fine vision will it happen for them shown inside can't miss surely and the keeper did magnificently well that's just a wonderful save how did he stop that And responsible for the corner is Dybala. That's great goalkeeping. Well, what a save that is. He was so alert there.
And a short corner, let's see. Zakaria. Quadrado. Rabio. And still a chance. Well, they survived the attack. Zakaria. Delicht. Is it going to end up being productive for them? And offside here. Zielinski struggling to keep the ball well the visitors very much dictating the tempo over the last 15 minutes or so they're creating plenty of chances and looking a constant threat you feel they have to take the lead at some point with this sort of domination spot on with that tackle and the emphasis is on creativity Magnificent defending. Vlahovic racing forward, trying to catch them out. Well, an example of a counter attack that went nowhere. Politano. Onguisa. Zielinski. Poor attempt at a pass, really. Vlahovic. Morata. Here's Quadrado. Well, they're moving the ball neatly enough. Just looking for that decisive pass. Well, he certainly wasn't offside by a mile. An unforced error, you've got to say. Rabio, Morata, and that'll be the goalkeeper's ball. If you're wondering about stoppage time, one minute to be added on. And with that, the first half draws to a close. Well, even the most talented players in the world can lose form from time to time. Paolo Dybala can do better, Stuart. Well, he didn't contribute enough in that first half. I think he needs to work harder to get on the ball. He was far too static. In my view, he's got to make more runs behind this back line in the second half. As anticipated, plenty of talking points so far. And now the second half is underway. Quadrado. Locatelli with it. Rabio. Zaccaria. Morata. Vlahovic. Well, possession seeded. Lorenzo Insigne. Zielinski. Look they look as though they want to make this move count. Looking for that final pass. Looking for the goal that would put them ahead. Shot attempted. And a crisp effort just over the top.
Alexandro. Getting in there to take it away. Politano. And a goal to give them the lead. They have their reward. Well, here it is again. Just look at the quality of the cross. It's inch perfect. And it's a good finish as well. Gets above it and heads it down. That's a top-class header. So the match has restarted, 1-0 here. So a half an hour remaining. Well, the visitors, as you can see, have enjoyed so much of the possession, but their attacking play hasn't been good enough so far. There's been too many safe passes and no real penetration. They certainly need to up the tempo if they're going to get back into this one. A bad pass it was. Locatelli. On the ball, Zaccaria. They might be able to get in now. Well, the goal was at his mercy. Well, it certainly was. He has to score there. been plenty of limbering up from substitutes and now both sides will make personnel switches Dusan Vlahovic in position Well, here's the replay, and it all starts off with that cross into the box, just begging for a teammate to get on the end of it. And the strike could not get any better. He hits through the back of the ball with such power. What a goal this is. Back underway, level pegging, one goal apiece in this game. Can they trouble the opposition this time? Zielinski. And it's a really poor challenge. Now, what's the referee going to do about it? And a yellow card, it's going to be Stewart. Yeah, the ref's got that right. It's a yellow card all day long. And with play stop, they will make the change now. Insigne. And here's Fabian pressing high to win the ball.
Well, here it is again, and credit to the goal scorer, but you have to ask questions of the keeper. He's got to have that near post cover for me. No wonder he's frustrated with himself. A big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Ten minutes to go. Vlahovic. Well, they're attacking, but time is the great enemy. Mario Rui. Here's Fabian. Well, by playing keep ball like this, they're keeping the opposition at bay. And Napoli might be onto something. And looking towards the back post. Well, but claimed by the goalkeeper. Well, they no longer have the ball. And showing fine vision. Pressure on to clear his lines. Could be a chance to break here. Artur. Oh, a nice looking pass. That will do it. The referee blows the whistle and maximum points for Napoli. What did you think of their overall display? Yes, Derek, there wasn't much in it, to be honest. Really competitive game with chances at both ends, but they probably just about edged it overall and deserved the result in the end. And in the final analysis, a really positive performance from this man, Stuart. Well, that was a great performance. His understanding of how to find space was brilliant today. And, of course, he scored two really good goals.